Right now I'm on my way to work. Totally forgot my glasses, which is very upsetting. But um, I'm supposed to be there at 8.25. It's like 8.13 right now. I have to pretty much open to close. I'm working for like nine hours today. Then after that, I'm going to go look at an apartment. Amir and I have to leave uh, July, July 20th, because that's when our lease is up. So we're going to leave then. So looking for an apartment right now is kind of stressful. So we're going to do that. Um, and that's pretty much my day. So I should probably continue driving. Come on, let's go. Yeah, yeah. let's go. Emmy? Look at your toes. <laughs> Who painted your toes? Mommy. Do you have painted toes? Do you have painted toes? No, your toes are okay. What about me? We need to get ready, and uh, after about four more friends come, then we're gonna clean up, and we're gonna do circle time. After circle time, we're gonna do work cycle, and then taekwondo. Sounds like a plan? You wanna do taekwondo? Why? You're so good at it. Arm hugs. Oh, they're good if you're too little to get your arm around somebody. Really? You hug people? I miss you. Blanket hugs. Everybody needs some kind of blanket. Tree hugs. Note, if you hug a pine tree too long, you'll get stuck on it. The fall down. The, the blocks fall down? Yeah. How did the blocks fall down? How did it fall down? How'd the purple one fall down? Pink fall down. Pink block fall down. Okay, can you um finish putting your pants on and go to finish taking a nap? I have to finish my other work. I have to make a, a, a calendar schedule for the work cycles we're going to do. You drive the truck, you do the work cycle to the work? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But can you put your pants on and then go lay down and finish your nap time? So while the kids are taking a nap, I need to um, curate our July summer camp uh, schedule. So I have to figure out what type of lesson we're going to do, the vocabulary, the activity, the art, um, like the theme of everything. So there's a total of six weeks and um, yeah, I'm almost done with it, but I need my boss told me that I need to finish it by today. And I started it like Tuesday, so I need to finish this. You know, there are some people who, without like doing research, enter the childhood development field without fully understanding the like difficulty that comes with it. Like a lot of people think that working with children means like playing all day. Because it's not like volunteer at a facility before you apply for a job. Because I mean, a lot of places um, are looking for like volunteers and helpers and it's a great way to get first-hand experience with early childhood education. Last couple of weeks here. So I can, you ready? Oh, there wasn't a stove? No. Oh, I didn't notice that. I just yeah. noticed how the kit to the 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 um the refrigerator was way too close to the door for my comfort. I was like, this yeah, is weird. There was no stove. Yeah, I could not cook. No. I could not cook. How can I cook? Yeah, I think he had like a little like burner type thing. Burner thing, yeah. But there's No. no That's like way. for like a student, like so long story short, we didn't really like the place. As soon as I walked in, I had a bad feeling about it. I was like, no, this is not the one. Yeah, that's a little expensive not to have a stove. For real? <laughs> 1900 for for that? I mean, it's, it's nice, but like... So what did you want for dinner? Did you want to go out? Yeah, we There's nothing really to go out. Yeah, our only options are like Juba and Indian food. Just everything at Juba Loki tastes the same. Same seasonings. Yeah. Same, just different meat. Mm -hmm. You order from that one place, get those shanks. Oh, yeah, if it's open. I don't even, I don't even know if it's open. 
Oh, for the morning from Ramadan? Yeah. <laughs> During Ramadan, when uh, my dad was here, Amir convinced my dad that he did not run the freaking blatant red light. Like, he ran a red light and tried to con and convinced him. He convinced my dad that he was seeing stuff. Who does that? He's so mean. <laughs> my dad felt like he was going senile. <laughs> It was kind of messed up. Like, it was hella messed up. He passed the light and uh, he's like, whoa, did, did, did you just run a red light? And then I I didn't deny it. I just said, it's green. <laughs> and, you know, when he looked back, it so happened to turn green. Well, it was green when I said it's green because I looked in my mirror and I said, because I, I paused, I was like, it's got to be turning green. I was like. And it, as soon as it turned, I was like, it's green. And then he looked, turned around, looked back. He's like, oh, okay. <laughs> and then when we when we, <laughs> when we passed up the next next light, he was like this, babe. <laughs> oh, why are you, why are you doing like that? <laughs> In my defense, right, that day, um, we were all in the house getting ready to go and pray Fajr, right? Oh, is that and, when he was, uh, he was hella late? He was like, he was like, I told everyone, I was like, all right, I'm getting ready to go go to Fudger. I was like, are you guys going to come? Or are you guys going to get ready? So Naeem's making wudu and everything, right? We have two sinks in the house, all right? So then Naeem's getting on his clothes and everything. And I go to the door and I start, and I'm, I'm about to open the door. And then all of a sudden he rises up. Like his heart just started Sorry. beating, like in that moment, it was like boom. I was like, oh, I'm making wudu. I was like, I'm thinking, I'm like, yo, yo, <laughs> <laughs> what's going on? But alhamdulillah, we made it. We uh, we dropped our cots 27 times, right? 27 times uh, multiplier. Plus the uh, praying half of the night as well, times 27 maybe. I put your keys up there because I stepped on it and it hurt my toe. Yeah, well, be careful where you put your keys. When you don't feel like cooking, but you got DoorDash. When you don't feel like cooking, and everything's halal. When you don't feel like cooking, and make bae pay for your food. I've been doing my photography business for a little over a year now. It's about a year and a half. So it's time that I kind of get a little bit more professional and update my photography services and like prices now that I have more experience with it and I believe that my photos are at that level where it's like yeah I could charge you a little bit more I'm keeping like my basic portrait prices the same which I find to be very affordable and still I think my event prices are affordable but right now I'm just you know still looking over it and also you know trying to write why choose shots by Q why choose me you should book me and then you could tell me like, oh, I liked you because of this and such and such and such. So then I can write, hey, you should choose me because people said that I'm really cool or whatever. Mm -hmm. so I just arrived at the Hayward Japanese Garden. I'm going to be doing um, a photo shoot here. It's not, it's a, it's a couple photo shoot, but they've been married for a while. So a couple of months ago, maybe, actually, I don't know if it was this year or the end of last year. But I was doing a photo shoot for a girl and um, she wanted to give the photo shoot to her friend for her birthday present. So now, like, her friend contacted me and was like, oh, I want to return the favor and do a photo shoot for the, for the girl and um, her husband. So now I am um, just getting my stuff together because the photo shoot starts at 2.30 and it's 2.22. So I'm going to go kind of scout the area and, um, and see what's up. So it says a private event, so I'm not sure if we're really allowed to go over there. So I need to check that out. You know, the thing about photography is sometimes people don't, sometimes things don't go as planned. So the place that we're at, the gardens, it closes pretty early, it closes at four. And um, the couple got stuck in traffic, so we're going to relocate to a place in Oakland, um, kind of like the Chabot Science place. Uh, it's at Joaquin Miller Park. Okay, yeah, I, I got it, I got it. Okay, no worries. We'll just be here. Like some here too, though. Mm -hmm. Yeah, oh, they're super adorable.
Mm -mm. Just slight video. Oh, okay. I've been trying to get back into vlogging, so. Ooh. That is awesome. So we just got done eating and having, um, like, dinner. And, um, like, I really enjoyed my time. Like, mashallah. The ladies, they're great. I had fun taking, like, the pictures. Couple was fun. Like, it was such a fun day. And I feel kind of bad because I spent all my day out. And um, I was just complaining to Amir yesterday that I don't spend enough time with him. And, like, I, I was, like, out the whole day. And like tomorrow, Sunday, I'm gonna be out the whole day again. Be self. And I feel like I'm being a little selfish at times. Like not giving us time to spend together. I should talk to him today. I should talk to him today. Hey, babe. How are you doing? Sorry I got back so late. I didn't mean to. Yeah, they invited me for like dinner and we ate some stuff. <sighs> I'm so tired. I need to take a shower. Is it wrestling? Okay, so first thing you have to do is take a USB drive to a client who lives 21 miles away. And then I have to go to a ballet recital. My boss bought me a ticket for her daughter, so I have to go to that. So um, that's pretty much my day today. And then when I come back, inshallah, Mary and I are gonna record Marriage Mondays. So I'll be back home around like 6, 6.30. So that's my day. Then I have to do more laundry and clean up. Okay, let's go. Oh, oh, Names on it. Oh, that oh, is cute. Uh, till Friday. Oh, okay. Yeah. Good. And we got my, like, recital was so cute a little dance recital thing it was super cute it was like the first time i've ever been to like a little dance show and it was so adorable i'm so glad my boss had me um, so now i gotta go home and do what i need to do what do you think of the uh thing so far this is a little i just feel like so like if you're only taking group shots right uh-huh so you're saying that for the extra half an hour, uh -huh. they're charging an additional five, five dollars for three to five, uh, ten dollars for five, seven, blah, blah, blah. So here, your hourly rate is that, and then you're reducing half an hour. You're saying that half an hour is worth five, ten, and fifteen dollars. Okay, I, I, we could take that out. So you think group shots should be 70 an hour and if they want solo shots? I mean, it's maybe the 75 if that's what you want, 35, whatever. Group shots are always going to have solo shots. Okay, can you fix that for me? Like put that in there somehow? Okay, thank you. It's just water boiling. Oops, did I get salt everywhere? Yes, I did. I got salt everywhere. I keep thinking this is chicken thigh and not chicken breast. But I think it'll still taste the same. 
I mean, not 100% the same because chicken breast and chicken thigh do not taste the same. seasoning I get. Darn it. I forgot to get vegetables. That's okay. 